Hey guys, Sock here from Socky Tech, and in today's video, we have a brand new update for millions of Samsung Galaxy smartphones. Now, this update is a security update that enhances the security of your smartphone, making it less prone to attacks or hacking. So, let me show you what I'm talking about. I'm also going to show you guys how to get the update. So, if I go to my settings and if I go over to my privacy and security, at the bottom, just a little at the bottom, we have the auto blocker option. You can see it says your phone is protected. Now when I tap on it, these are all the options that are in fact turned on, which is protecting my smartphone. So that's great. And we also have maximum restrictions, as you know, that is an extra strong protection suite for people that are just looking for maximum protection. So here's the good news. This module, the auto blocker module, has gotten a brand new update. Now, before the update, I want to show you guys what version you should be at. So if I go to my apps right over here, and if I type in auto blocker right over here, you can see I am at version 1.2.01.16. That is the last version. Now, let's get the latest update. So all you do is you go to my website. The link's going to be down below. Once you are at the website, you scroll down, it says latest version of auto blocker, and you can read what this is all about, but you do want to go down under download. You want to click the link. Okay. Once you click the link, it's going to open up the galaxy store. And from here you can update this. Now the latest version that we have is going to be 1.2.02.1. It is six megabytes. It updates the underlying parameters. So I'm going to tap on update. All right. We're going to install that. We're going to go back to my settings, go into, let's see, apps, auto blocker. And now I am in fact at the latest version. All righty. So just to show you guys what's going on here, if I go back over to security and privacy, uh, auto blocker is still enabled, remains enabled if you have it enabled, but basically it blocks apps from unauthorized sources, blocks commands by USB cable, blocks malware images that were sent to you via a text message, and also blocks non-official software updates. If you want any one of those, you can disable it, no problem. To disable it, you do have to put your fingerprint or your PIN, which is great, okay? But basically all these Features have gotten an under the hood update, making your phone even more secure. By the way, you don't have to have this turned on unless you have some really specific security requirements, maybe for work or something. OK, this is just going to block everything. OK, I mean, you can do it if you want, but it's really not that necessary for the average consumer. But this one, I would keep it on and you're going to be good to go. So great that we have up-to-date security on the phone. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, drop them down below. Let me know. Guys, fantastic day.